Hello. Today. I don't know what today is. What is it, the fifth? No. Wait, what's it? Yeah, Wednesday, fifth April, 1989, year of our war. And I'm sitting here cleaning my M16H2 service water with M203 grenade long but I'm not too motivated about it. Anyway, I just decided to see how okay, the deal is I got work. Right now I gotta clean my weapon. And I'm in my room and I'm gonna make the tape and clean my weapon at the same time. So this right here is alcohol. Anyway, it's a bolt. Anyway, how you doing? I'll be rotating. July. Yes. I'll be rotating out of here. I'll be rotating out of here in July. And I'm going to go to Camp June. My soda is gone. Somebody drank my damn soda. Damn it all. Damn it. Anyway, I'm going to go to Camp Lejeune, North Carolina. In July, well, actually, when I rotate, I'm going to take 30 days leave, okay? I'm going to take 30 days leave. And um, uh, that's what the United States is about. Who am I going to say? In the Senate and between the Senate and 15th of July. Okay. I gotta get this damn thing done. I haven't had any chance to clean my weapon. We had an inspection, the army had an inspection, and it was like my weapon specifically was named dirty because I have not had time. Me and a couple other people, we haven't had time, we've been working. We have time to get down there and clean our weapons up. So now, I brought my, room, my weapon in my room. To, for illegal maintenance. Of course, you don't know that, but this is a documentary that illegal maintenance is being done to the weapon. So, right here, I put filled the sink up with hot water. I got some washing powder, scouring powder, not scouring powder, washing powder for clothes. Fill the sink up with hot water. Put some of that in there. I got a scrub brush. Just scrub the hell out of my weapon. So, it'll be not supposed to do that. But well, right now I'm using alcohol for uh, a cleaner because it doesn't leave. There's only too bad of a smell. You turn it in and suspect it and smell your weapon. See if you use like WD-40 or something weird like that. It can't smell alcohol, and it gets rid of the smell of the soap that you just used. Scrub it off with the sink. <sighs> Basically, I'm sitting here talking about nothing. Just decided to make a tape. You're gonna give me a square walk. But, I don't know the fan. Didn't look too good off out of from the rain. The lower receiver. You know what? I don't want to clean this. I have to. Um, dream. Okay. No. Oh. Well, you got back from Korea. That was a good deployment. Ah. Uh, we have high going one mission. It's pretty bad. I don't even hear about this in the States. But we had, uh, 
couple Marines, well, a lot of Marines died. We had a CH-46 go down, and the next day, CH-53 went down. Two helicopters, two different days. And, uh, well, I'll tell you, actually, what happened was I was sitting up on the hill, sitting on the hill, uh, 762 in Korea. I was sitting up there, and there was a, a radio, uh, free trans. Oh, be damn, look at this damn thing. It was a radio retrans. So, I mean, it was a relay. So what basically all we had to do is sit up on top of the hill. Our team sat up on top of the hill and relayed messages for other teams that were in the bush. Okay, and they, they sent them to us and we sent them back to the uh, to the COC. And I was sitting on the radio and we're sitting there. I was, it, was, it was my watch. I was on the radio watch, talking all this traffic. And uh, a message comes over. It says, be advised that CH, uh, CH-46 just went down. Um, uh, something, 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 I forget. Anyway, he's told me a CH-46 uh, uh, went down. He's like, I'll be damned. And, uh, you know, went down and, and uh, got back to the rear. Well, anyway, before I got back to the rear, it was the next morning. And, uh, again, I wasn't on radio watch this time. Sit on top of the hill, and I saw traffic moving through. Military vehicles was over on, uh, 762, and I got my binos, and I was looking down, down the, down the valley, and traffic was going through. Military traffic vehicles, American vehicles doing the operation. But I caught fire with form with artillery. Got on, got on the line, used artillery, and, uh, some close air. We had some A6s we could use. So he was using A6s and uh, A6 and artillery one fired. And he's pulling in the net. A siege 53 just went down and grid such and such, such and such. I looked at my map. I looked at my map. There's that grid area. I got my binos. Looked down there. And sure enough. I see something burning down there. I looked again. It was a it was a it was a CH fifty three helicopter that went down. Down on the net reported uh saw a visual on the accident. And um so the other birds started coming in, banding vehicles. About twenty two people died out of it. I don't know if it was in a my favor, it was pretty it was pretty bad. I think we're dying. And that, and that 53, that, that crash, right before that, one of our teams was on that bird. Went down, inserted that team. They got off the bird. They were coming to pick me up. Me and uh, my team up. Yeah. Got them off, come, come around, pick us up, up top of this hill. On its way, it just, it just crashed. It was... Got water in my weapon. It was not a. It wasn't very. It wasn't very good. You know what? This this is a two or three. This is a grenade launcher right here. The two of a grenade launcher. <coughs> anyway, we're gonna kill people. It's happened to Craig. We got back, and then uh, right now I'm I'm like in a non-working status, I'm working but I'm in a non-working status because uh, I've been rotating back to the States here about three months so I can't really do anything. This is my towel I drive my body off with, can you believe I'm doing this? It's gonna repel. The repel point. Say hi, Buzzy.
Nice to Buffini. We're here to, to risk our lives just for the fun of sending our face at the ground at maybe 60 miles an hour, perhaps. <laughs> This is infamous Steve Bose, USMC. So if we die today, it's his fault because he hooked this up. Yes. It'll be fine. Mm -hmm. Beautiful day today. This is the emergency vehicle just in case somebody faps in. Team. This is the mission. Beautiful yeah, scenery, it's jungle. Is the green one? Yeah, it's recording. You push and die. I love you. Alright, here's our first contestant today. Yeah. That ain't bad. There he goes. What? How is the uh the whip? Yeah. You got any problem clearing it? Trying to put your brake on. Something's wrong. The rest ain't Slack out of birds. I'm too hard to out of birds. <laughs> Ready down there, Blue Man?
big fists out of line. You hear him popping on the way down? Yeah. Mom, you see this? This is what we do for entertainment. Look at people like that. And we jump off things like this. Pretty neat, huh? Even this rock is you. Ooh, ouch. When you do not know how to repel. See that? You stick in the ground. Now your arms break off the This stick had an improper repel technique. This is from the bottom looking up. The jungles of Okinawa, Japan. Hey, yeah. <laughs> Throw it. Tell me when you're ready. It's gonna go on. This is the jungles of Okinawa. As you can see it's thick and steep and awesome. The mud run area. Going up and down this river. Beautiful. There's the bridge. Go through the jungle here. Uh oh. Enemy's been here. Ammo box. Yeah. Yeah, hold on. Let me get out of this shit. <laughs> That's gonna look good on camera if you're falling on my ass. Huh? You're what? Yeah. Go ahead. Who's who's ah! He recovered. Hey man, look at him. It's like pretty cool in the clouds or what? Huh? The clouds? Yeah. It's a nice young, motivated reconnaissance marine. Young's right. Adam, Fausto, Beanie. Trying to go Ozzy off the bridge. Can he do it? We don't know. We're about to find out. Not a good sign. Treacherous train lies below. And he's gonna do it face first. Look at this. Rocks at the bottom. To fap in. There he goes, Australian. How was it? 